time to eat this donut. Get in my belly. Donuts. Hey guys, today we are showing you the Dough Bar Variety Pack. Ooh. So good, these flavors are awesome. Some of our favorites. So I'm just gonna show you guys how easy it is to make and then you guys are gonna watch me eat it and see how delicious it is. And then you're gonna wanna go and order an entire pack, maybe 20. All right, so in this pack, this is the A pack. You guys can see, and the flavors are apple pie, cake batter, candy blue, and cinnamon. So candy blue and cake batter are like my favorites, right? I'm doing the cinnamon toast crunch because it's breakfast and it's kind of like cereal donut. So Who doesn't want donuts for breakfast. Exactly. So. Pat's still just standing here lurking. <laughs> so I just want to show you guys how you can come in. They're packaged like this in plastic. And then the frostings come and the toppings come, yeah, zoom. Like this with your macros, your nutrition information per serving. And it comes with an icing container and a topping container. And you just heat these up, like even though they're plastic, I usually do it for like three seconds at a time and kind of stir it and it heats up fine. I always just pop these in the freezer because I don't know when I'm going to eat them and I don't want them to go bad. So pop them in the freezer. Pop, I pop the whole thing in the freezer and it stays good. I, I think it says on here. I mean, honestly, I've eaten these donuts like up to a year in the freezer. I don't know if I'd recommend doing that, but fine they taste great they so still taste they still taste good <laughs> I will vouch for that so basically I'll just bring this with me I just popped this donut in the microwave for 30 seconds and it's nice and warm it's been sitting there for a couple minutes now and it's still really warm you don't want to do more than 30 seconds um, just because it will start to kind of like overcook the donut so if it's not Defrost it in 30 seconds. I would just like take it out and do it for like another five seconds like five second intervals um, So now I'm gonna heat up the frosting in the plastic container <laughs> Which I don't know if it's good or not, but I do it. I think it's fine <laughs> so I'm just gonna put that down. Here's the icing. This is the cinnamon toast crunch icing. I'm just gonna pop it in for three second intervals until it's Good to go even though I just put three minutes on there <laughs> Just kind of keep track <laughs> and see. All right, so see how it's kind of pretty much defrosted. I'm just gonna put it in for like a couple more seconds. Um, yeah. Mm. Oh my gosh, that's so good. That's literally so much cinnamon. Okay. So I'm gonna have Pat take this real fast. And I'll show you guys how, <laughs> I just tripped over water. I'm gonna show you guys how to make that like really cool design. If you go to Dobar's, um, Dober Donuts Instagram, you can see they have all of their donuts like really pretty and decorated. So this is just an extra step if you wanna make your donut look Instagram worthy. Um, Cause we're all used to eating our, our stuff cold. So, so we can get that picture. So basically I just literally pour the icing into a like plastic Ziploc bag. And this part's messy. But it comes out looking really nice, so it's worth it. And yeah, you get to test it out, the flavor before you eat the whole donut, right? So, see that? I'm just gonna eat that off my finger. <laughs> Excuse my look, I have not, I just woke up. Um, so yeah, I'm just, make sure it's focused. I'm just pushing the icing to the corner. This is just like basic icing. 
directions. And then you just cut the corner and do your really pretty design. So I just need other drawer. Scissors, thanks. <laughs> so you just cut the tip. Can you zoomed in so you can see the detail? I'm just kidding. And now you gotta just figure out the design. So I'm gonna do a pretty simple one. No pressure. I don't know if you wanna zoom in closer so you can see how pretty and clean it looks versus just topping it like random. Theorizing. Beautiful. And then I'll just go across to finish up the design. And this is like fun too, getting to decorate your own. Even though like I just want to eat the donut, like it's fun. And it kind of makes you appreciate the flavor in the donut so much more when you put time and effort into making it look pretty. So if you're the type of person that just like shoves food and like eats and like has trouble like with self-control and stuff like that, like this helps because <laughs> you make it look really pretty and then like you don't want to just like scarf it down. It's not like just an Oreo. Make that basic. All right, so now that I have my pretty little design with my icing, it's pretty fast, right guys? We're gonna just take the cinnamon toast crunch. Don't mind my ratty hands. <laughs> I need to get a manicure <laughs> tomorrow, hopefully. Um, anyways, you just top it with the cinnamon toast crunch, make it look pretty. And then we'll take a picture and I'm gonna share on Instagram. You guys will see this picture probably before you see the video. And <laughs> if you ever see this video, <laughs> I suck at editing. I'm sorry. I'm trying to get better. <laughs> so, yeah. So, I'm just going to finish topping it. All the big pieces first, and then I'll kind of just like sprinkle the rest on that's like left over. So, this is what's left over, and I'll just kind of, yeah, just get that crumb on there for that edit extra texture. <laughs> that added texture. <laughs> All right. So, that's it. <laughs> And it's still warm. <laughs> so that's, let me zoom out and foc refocus. Focus fire, okay. So that's it. That's that beauty right there. And these are the macros for it. So not bad. Guys, it's packed with 11 grams of protein. Not much sugar. It's a really awesome treat and they taste delicious so go try them if you haven't yet i love them so now i'm gonna i'm gonna take a picture of this and i'll come back and show you guys me eating it <laughs> just to persuade you more that you have to just go and get them but i'm just gonna show you guys just how it comes packaged um so yeah this just comes with the four donuts and the four different flavors. This is the apple pie, streusel. This one's really good if you like apple pie. I am not an apple pie fan, and I like this one, guys. And you can ask anyone in, that knows me, like I hate apple pie, and this one's really good. Like I'm not even kidding. <laughs> and the cake batter is just obviously a great one to go to. I'm saving this for my birthday. My birthday's in a couple days. So I'm gonna eat that on my birthday. And then this is a new flavor, which I post a lot about because it's obviously one of my favorite because it's so colorful and it has M&Ms and sprinkles so it's just it's really good you can't go wrong honestly with any flavor like they're all amazing so yeah this beauty right here it's going in my belly it's gonna fuel my deadlifts today all right I'm gonna take a couple pictures and then I'm going to eat it and get ready for the gym so catch up in a second <laughs> All right, it's time to eat this donut. Get in my belly. Mm. So good. I love cinnamon toast crunch.
This is so good. All right, I have to go get ready to go deadlift. I'm gonna finish eating my donut. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And um, I will put any details for ordering, where to order, how to order, when to order, all that stuff in the, in the bio. And I hope you guys get to try these yummy things because they're so good. And yes, so I will talk to you guys later. I hope you enjoyed this video. And go get yourself some donuts. Donuts. All right, bye. <laughs>